a mindset exercise to help you stay relaxed on competition day. Hello and welcome to the next episode of Unstoppable Question. I'm Danielle Poole from Dressage Plus. And today's video, I wanted to share with you a mindset exercise that will help you stay relaxed and calm on competition day. And I have shared this exercise before, uh, but in past videos, but it is such a really, uh, really such a powerful exercise that it's worth sharing again with you and reminding you uh, if maybe you haven't used this exercise for a while or you haven't used it before, uh, so that you can use it for your next competition. So I talk a lot, so when I'm working with riders uh, either on the phone through phone coaching or through my online course or in writing lessons I talk a lot about the ability to stay present in the in the moment ride in the stride and how powerful that is um, as an exercise that we need to practice all the time on how to stay focused and concentrate in our riding so that we're not getting um, caught up in what if thoughts and worrying about something that might happen in in the future so whether that's in in three strides a shy they might do or whether that's they might buck when you take them into a busy warm-up or whatever it might be uh, we talk a lot about how to exercises to keep you in the present moment riding each stride because when you're in the present moment you um, cannot experience nerves or fears or what if thoughts because you're just there with your horse you're in your body you're riding uh, you're not in your head worrying about certain what ifs and things that might go wrong so that's one of the most powerful things you can practice riding in the present moment however for this mindset exercise we're actually going to talk about taking our mind to the future so out to the end of a successful ride and so when we think about uh, a competition coming up that you might be feeling a bit nervous about a bit excited about and you're getting the pre like tummy butterfly jitters uh, or you're you're thinking why did I enter this as you're driving to the competition in the morning um, what am I doing uh, anytime you're experiencing that we can use this mindset exercise to shift your focus from the present like in that moment when you're, you're feeling nervous and worried and you're in a state of um, anxiety in a sense uh, to the future and the end of your ride where you'll be feeling relaxed and calm and confident and satisfied and feeling proud and and that sense of relief that yay you made it through the day you achieved it you did it and so we want to take your mind to either that last final halt and salute where you get to breathe and you just really feel relaxed again or that last unsaddle uh, or my favorite is actually thinking about how I'll be feeling on the drive home from a competition so because the drive to a competition can often be quite a heightened <laughs> um, emotional state. You can be feeling quite nervous as you're driving to the comp. And if you think about in that moment when you're feeling nervous, how good you'll feel when you're driving home. So when we're driving home from a comp, we're well, often a little bit tired, which makes us feel a bit more relaxed and at ease and we're feeling satisfied and, and proud of ourselves for accomplishing it and all these great positive feelings. Um, you can all probably think about a time at a competition where you've done your last halt salute, you're unsaddling or riding back to the float and you think, wow, now I feel relaxed. Now I could get on and ride a really nice dressage test because you've got positive emotions, calm, re relaxed emotions going through your body instead of that pressure and those nerves. So I want you to use this exercise um, as a way to shift from a nervous heightened energy to a relaxed, calm, confident energy in the lead up, either the week before you comp, if you notice yourself feeling nervous, or the morning of the competition, especially when you're saddling up, if you're making your horse feel nervous because you're so nervous, thinking about how you'll feel when you're pulling the bridle off rather than putting the bridle on. And keep shifting to that state and feeling it in your body, feeling relaxed, feeling that bit of a oh, that tired kind of, um, heavier feeling through your body which is much nicer feeling that an um, anxious kind of up energetic heightened feeling so obviously this exercise is such a great one for competition nerves 
performance nerves, but also using it for um, a lead up to a clinic if you're feeling nervous about a clinic or a club ride or something like that you've got coming up, but also utilizing it for non-horsey things like uh, social environments. If you've got a social event coming up you're um, a little bit anxious for or a job interview, or even just if you have to give a meeting at work and, and you don't love public speaking, think about how good you'll feel at the end when you've finished that uh, talk or discussion. Um, and sharing these kind of exercises with your children, if you've got children or, or people that, if you're um, other riders that you know of that can utilize this exercise, please feel free, free to share this, this video link on with them so that they can also um, make use of these different mindset exercises or tricks we can play on our mind to help us enjoy riding and competing more. So I'll leave you with that one. Um, have a play with it. It's one I use all the time, even for something that I just don't want to do, like, I don't know, maybe there's something on the computer that I, a personal thing that I need to do, like get some, um, my accounts done or something like that. And I just can't be bothered. I always think how good I'll feel at the end of it. And it makes me start the process, which usually means I finish the process. So using it for those kind of situations as well. So have a great week and I will see you in the next video. Bye.